Hi folks, can you see me squall squires there now? I was just using the same wires as what they used. But it's just tinting them beforehand, you see. Anyway, uh, I'll carry on. This is video 11, I believe. While I'm here on video 11, can I take the opportunity to say hello to the people that's watching my videos on different websites? Someone wrote to me uh, a couple of nights ago from a site called Whoopee. Whoop, I think it's whoopee.com. I don't know. It's in Japan or somewhere. It's in Japan or China. Or oh, writing's China. I can't read none of it. <laughs> I can't read none of it. <clears throat> anyway, uh, hello. I'll, uh, <laughs> see you in a bit. Quiet, please. Quiet, please. Right, take two. Right, so as you can see, uh, stickers off now. Well, not the sticker. There should be a sticker there, but the socket's out now. And uh, them wires, of course, that went down now to the front panel. Of course, they've all been taken off. And... Uh, it was of course the mode supply as we said I'm just about in just in the middle of replacing the mode supply so, um, so just I just wanted to tell you that 8.2 volts or roughly goes to this positive here which goes to one at pins here as well right two wires there one to the UK FM switch if you like a normal switch and the other one if you like comes back and supplies all this lot puts positive to that positive to that side at wafer on them four and also on you see the, the red wire linking across to other side and that's what it does it supplies up the whole mode switch here so when it's in UK all that lot gets robbed just all gets robbed of supply so it can't do an out and then as soon as you put it back to normal it gives 8.2 volts back here and allows this to do it all anyway carry on better got rid of some more SWR tape I'm just about to replace this wire now can you see I pulled tape off well, well but you can't leave that line around so I'll just replace it with a new white wire end of story <laughs> no one will be any wiser goodbye goodbye it's always good folks to have a few projects <laughs> it's always good to have a few projects going on back to problem in hand ok so I've got my front back on now I'm all wired back up um, I'll just do uh, uh, a black tie clip to find now for that bit of propagation ramps Yeah. 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 Yeah, okay. He said he won't splits on his Cobra 148. Yeah, so anyway, I've done all that now, right? And uh, obviously I've tested it again and it's back to where it were before. And uh, now, all it is as a matter of now is going down. Check, you see? Can, can you see... Um, can you see these tracks here? They're just links, they're known as links. Can you see how they're bent? That was the first thing I did when I opened this radio up, was to separate them two, they were touching. So I'll be straightening all stuff like that up. Can you see this resistor that's right down here, that's right next to the transformer, can you see that? If that resistor touches that transformer, folks, we're in serious trouble. So that's what it'll be now. It'll be a matter of going through the whole radio and straightening all the resistors back to vertical, what someone's disturbed. They're all over the place. Can you see that one there? Right bent over, nearly touching some others here. You just don't want that. You just don't want that. Then if it goes portable or out like that, it's going to be okay, you know? So that's the next mission. And... Um, I'd, I'd have opened to get one of these for him, this for you. Hello, radio check, hello, radio check. Can anybody hear me out there, over? It's a good rig, isn't it? Hey, could you give me an audio report, whoever you are, and uh, just have a listen to me? What does it sound like, this, over? Hello, radio check. Can anybody hear me out there, over? 
Sag's doch mal, wer mir gefreut. Äh, ist is die Audio okay, aber? Oh, thank you very much, buddy. Uh, the only one here at uh, Bradford, just uh, testing an old time out over.